name is Ram Samocha. I'm the director of Draw to Perform, which is a company for drawing performance where uh, people share their uh, art live in front of the uh, audience. We began designing Enable quite a few years ago now and we were approached by a guy called Barry and he had multiple sclerosis and was paralyzed from his neck downwards and he asked me and Pete and a couple of our designer friends if we could design something for him that, that would allow him to, to paint again and we made the very first Enable device out of that and since then we've just been on a journey of making it more accessible and more affordable and more feature rich. So we've been working with Ram since 2016 and it's been a great relationship uh, being part of his Draw to Perform festivals and it's great to have a person who's really enthusiastic about the performance aspect of art and really brings a lot of character and energy into the project. The idea came from uh, this, the recognition that uh, people that working with an Enable it's a little bit hard for them to uh, move uh, in the city. I thought it would be nice to help them uh, uh, travel uh, on maps. What excites me so much about this project is just how many different minds have kind of come together and how cross-media it is. And then we've got this brief of, of outside spaces and just seeing all the various artists interact with that and the different maps. It's just such a beautiful blend of, of creativity. I was particularly interested in making the wheelchair part of the creative process as an art tool rather than something that's functional or that's sometimes seen as being in the way. I was interested because it's art, basically I'm interested in anything arty, but also because I have trouble standing up to do big bits of art and, and I thought it would be a good opportunity to test the devices. Because it's a, a, a tour that's happening now, the idea was uh, letting uh, the artist have a, a, a go on uh, vintage uh, maps of Brighton, uh, including the history of Brighton into to this tour. We're going to be in a really interesting area of Brighton and Hove, right sort of on the cusp of Brighton and Hove, in a locations that have a lot of different architectural styles and a lot of history. It's a real eye-opener and I hope people will come along and, and be able to discover that different point of view and enjoy some really imaginative and wonderful art that we've made.